Animations are a great way to bring your Make Code Arcade games to life, and it's easier than you think. Let's take a look at how we can add animations to our games. So I'm going to go to the home page of Make Code Arcade and create a new project. I'll call it My Animation. Now here in the Make Code Editor, let's go ahead and add a background color for our game, uh, something I always like to do. And then I'll go ahead and add a sprite. So I'll create a sprite here. Now, one thing I want to show you, if you click in the Advanced tab of your toolbox drawer, you'll see a new category called Animation. And if we open it up, you can see we've got some interesting looking blocks here. Um, so let's go ahead and explore what these do. So for the first block, let me go ahead and drag this out into my program here. And it says Animate My Sprite, so the sprite that you want to have animated. And it has um, a frames, uh, an interesting frames um, editor here. Uh, so let's go ahead and click that to see what it looks like. Now an animation is simply a series of still images that are strung together. So it looks like the image is moving or animating. And this animation editor looks a lot like the image editor. But you'll notice on the right here, is a space where you can add a series of images to form the animation. So let's go ahead and see what that looks like. So for example, if I was to uh, create an image here, um, let's say a pink ball, and maybe it has um, some highlights that animate. Um, so this is one image in my animation. I can add another image by clicking on this plus icon here. Uh, which will create another image that I can draw. Or what I can do is actually copy or duplicate uh, the current image that I just drew. So I'm going to duplicate this one. And then for, um, for this image, um, let's move this highlight. So um, we'll delete this uh, highlight here, and draw another highlight around um, the bottom here. And I'll do that for, uh, for four frames. So, um, so this way our animation will move around, our highlight rather, will, of the, this ball or balloon, I'm not quite sure what it is yet, um, <laughs> will move around um, the four sides of the circle. So let's take a look at that. Um, so I've got four still images that are part of my animation here. To see what the animation actually looks like, I can click this play button up here. So if I click on play, you can see in this little image here what my animation will look like. And it disappears because you can see I've got a blank image down here. So if I want to delete one of the images from my animation, I can just click on the trash icon, which will delete it. And now you can see my animation is playing. The highlights are moving around the ball here. I can change the interval. Uh, or the speed in which my animation is animating. So for example, if I wanted to change it to 100 milliseconds, my animation is moving really fast now. So, so that's why you create your own animation. But we also have a really cool gallery of existing animations you can choose from here. Um, and notice they've got this little film icon in the bottom left corner to indicate that these are indeed animations. And if I hover my mouse, over any of these animations. You can see what they look like um, and see if you want to choose them. Um, so lots of fun animations to choose from here. So I'm going to go ahead and just pick this little ducky animation. You can see it pre-populates my animation with some still images that are part of the animation. And my little ducky is animating up here in the right corner. So I'm just going to go ahead and click done. So in this block, I can pick the frames that form my animation. I can also select the time interval um, that the animations will run. So this is the, the time that's waited between each frame of the animation. Um, and then I can also to choose to play my animation through once, or I can turn the loop property to on. And this means that the, um, my sprite will continually animate. So uh, now let's look at a different type of animation. So to do this, I'm going to create another sprite. C 
So um, another different type of Sprite. Let's um, pick maybe, uh, what do you think, a strawberry? Let's do a strawberry Sprite. Um, and then I'm gonna go to my animation toolbox drawer again and grab this second type of animation and drop it in here. And I'm going to animate my strawberry Sprite this time. Um, so this animation um, has a list of pre-built movement type animations that you can apply to your sprite. So you can see in this drop down, we've got a bunch of different pre-built animations um, that will, will apply to your sprite. So fly to center, shake, let's see what shake does. And look in your simulator to see what happens. Okay, it kind of just shakes around. Um, bounce, uh, bounce right. This is a fun one. I like the bounce animation. You can see what that looks like. It looks like it's just kind of falling down and bouncing. <laughs> so that's a fun one. There's parachute uh, animation. So that kind of just looks like um, the strawberry is parachuting down. Um, so you can try playing around with some of these um, built-in animations here. Um, you can also set the duration for this animation. So this this time setting is from the beginning of the animation to the end. Um, it runs two seconds and this will either speed it up or slow it down. So if I do 200 milliseconds instead of two seconds, that should go really fast. Yeah, it's almost too fast. I didn't see, quite see that. So I'm gonna change it back to two seconds, uh, which I think is a pretty good duration for that parachute animation of my strawberry. Um, I can also choose, just like the other animation block, to turn the loop uh, flag to on and again what this will do is it will constantly loop through the animation um, and when and you notice that after each animation the sprite re, re, will return to the original position that it started at so it'll just do that same movement animation over and over again so I hope this was helpful uh, these are some fun and easy ways to bring your arcade games to life with animation <laughs>